Oh, where the fuck have you been, man? Yeah, I came as soon as I could. I don't pay for as soon as I could. Sleep with half the women in Liberty City, no doubt. What's wrong with you, man? You're acting like an asshole. You think I don't know that? You think I like being like this? Then what's wrong, T? I fucked up. Good and proper. I worked on Gonquin Nightlife 20 years. I beat everyone. Mayors, rivals, drugs, everyone. And this time, I fucked up. I'm the only man in the history of this town with the hottest gay and straight clubs at the same time, and I'm about to lose everything. What are you talking about, T? I don't know if it's that idiot Evan, or, or the economy, or this fucking cocaine, or the pills, which I am not taking anymore, but this time, I fucked up. Oh. Oh. I've done a deal with the wrong devil, man. I'm such an idiot. Things have been bad before, man. You get us out of it. I fight. You plot, together we get out of it. Sure, but we've never been this fucked before. Hey, you saved me, man. Made me. Gay Tony will always be the king of this town. You are this town. I sold the business to two different people, and they each think they own the lot. Man, we're fucked. So I'll go tell them they gave you the money as a present. If they don't like it, I take them to the special VIP room at the bottom of the West River. <laughs> it's gonna be very crowded in the VIP room. These are not nice people, and there's a lot of them. And right now, you and me have to go play nice with one of them so they don't start sending rent a Goomba into the club. Fuck. It's gonna be okay, man. Yeah, whatever. Meanwhile, there's a there's this blogger, this nebbish with an internet connection, bad-mouthing me all over town. Do you know this guy? The, the celebrinator? Celebrinator what? I, whatever. Come on. All right, who's the girl? There wasn't a girl, man. There's always a girl. Head down to the pier. We're meeting Rock at the driving range. We doing something for Rocco? The kid who took your money? Yes, one of the joys of getting old is being ordered around by people below the age of consent in Utah. Don't you mean it's one of the joys of borrowing money you can't pay back? He can take my money, blackmail me, put a gun to my head, but if I'm caught in bed with him, it's me who goes to jail. Rocco struck me as an insecure prick, but I didn't think he rode like that. He doesn't. I don't think so, at least. You think he does? Well, that pent-up suburban hard man angst? The fake tan and muscles can be confusing. Actually, he reminds me of Evan. So sue me, I got a type. Yeah, sure. You could call crazy coke addict moron a type. You been reading my love me profile? Lonely old husband sees crazy cokehead with bulging orange biceps? Enjoy your youth, Luis. You don't appreciate it until it's over. Oh, yeah. I'll look back on these years of getting shot at and helping you clean up puke as the best times of my life. Let's go find him. Rock, hey, how are you? There they are, the spick and the fag. Tony, shit, you got burrito breath. You ain't been eating Mexican again, have you? Yo, Rock, you invested in the wrong clubs, man. Maybe split sides is more your vibe. Oh, but a bum. I'm sure I would have found that funny if I spoke spick. Real shame, I'll have to ask my maid to translate for me. Rock, what do you need? I need you to help me get some information out of this union prick who's decided to get an overinflated opinion of himself. These fucking guys, stuck in the 1970s or something. Where is he? He's right down there. Fuck! <laughs> you fucking missed me, you piece of shit. Fucking prick. Oh, big man. Yeah, yeah, you fuck, you missed me, I'm bitch. gonna get down there and go you talk missed. to him. You swing like a You flag. hit him with some balls when I tell you to, huh? <laughs> you think you can do that for me, Louise? Yeah, I'll give it a try. What are we doing, man? We're keeping our most important investor happy. Just hit it already. you tacos for sports. Breathe, Lou. Remember to breathe. <laughs> Ugh. 
There you go! Who ain't playing ball, then? Give it up! There's a guy who works at Libel, a foreman on a Columbus Avenue job. He's the guy holding this up. You got more than that. I know it. Fuck you, all right? Fuck you. There ain't nothing else. Why is he moving it? Damned if I know. Don't Rocco have someone else to hit the batting cage for him? You've met the guy, haven't you? I can't imagine he's got too many friends. <laughs> oh! You and I both know that ain't it. All right, okay, okay. Jack Duffy with the transport workers. He's getting fat off the other guys. So you got those two guys. Untie me now, asshole! Rocco. The Sunday driver. Where'd you learn to play golf, Lou? Right here, right now. Needs must, don't? To be honest, I never fancied the game. I find the clothes you have to wear kind of unflattering. I hope you didn't miss on purpose there. You're not gonna wear any tour championships, that's for sure. Shit! That a boy! That ain't it. You and me know that ain't it. This comes from right up top. The head of the LTA. He's in with the Messina, so you can't do shit. You guys are fucked, okay? The Messina's are gonna be all over your ass. We're gonna do something about that. Much as it pains me, we better get down there. Shit. What you got us into? 
Shut up, Lou! He didn't mean anything by it! Don't fucking kill me! I think we lost him. That was a pleasant outing, Rock. Where's that put us with you know what? We square? Square? What you borrowed? At those points? You ain't even making a dent on the interest. Besides, I'm about to have to do all the messy work on this guy myself. No, but I, I, I told you shit. I told you everything. I'll see you girls later. Jesus! Come on, let's head back to the apartment. Hey, you know, I'm really warming to that guy. Like a back case of crabs. Crabs are easy to get rid of. Believe me on that one. Thank you for sharing. We're business partners. We share everything. The emphasis is on business, bro. You can keep your crabs to yourself. Sorry, man, but I really got us in the shit here, Luis. Tony, man, you gotta calm down. You're really pushing me. Yeah, well, if you weren't out chasing tail, and this was a two-man operation like it should be, then maybe things will be holding together better. Oh, I'm getting blamed for this now? Oh, of course. Whenever I come to the clubs, you ask me to run off on some stupid errand like a chump. You don't ever let me into the serious shit. And you do deals without even telling me. Until it comes time to protect your ass from whoever you got your fatwa the day all from. All right, all right. Maybe I've taken you for granted. I'll change. I'll be better. Yeah, thank you. But I don't believe it. Here we are, bro. Rest up, okay? Listen, Lou, would you mind paying Maury a visit? He says he needs help with something. I know he's a bit of a schmuck, but we owe the man money, and I don't want him anywhere near the clubs. I feel you there, T. That guy is a social atom bomb. I'll go see him. Sorry. Hey, what the fuck? Hey, what the fuck? What's going on? Ah, oh, my heart. Cool, all right?
North Holland, yo. All right, then. Let's do it. Sounds like a plan, eh? Hang out for a minute, I'll be by. Nice, bro. I'll relay the message to Enrique. Where can I take you? Yeah, man. Going to Boabo. Good as gold. This is it. Gracias, papi. Oh, hey, Lou! It's Luis. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Come here, give me some love right here. <laughs> so what'd you want? Tony said you needed a favor. What, I look like a charity case to you? Can I plead the fifth on that one? Ah, oh, that's, that's funny. You're funny. Yeah, you're fucking funny. Funny for a guy with all those pecs. She got the lats of a little girl. And Man, you need calf implants. <laughs> look at you. And, you know, I'm guessing just, just from looking at you, you ain't exactly packing a 10-inch hose, man. Me? <laughs> I make girls wince. Ah, uh, wince. Oh. Just to level with you for a minute, bro. <laughs> Tony owes you money. Tony's my boss and my friend. So I'll help you out a little. But if you mention my host again, I'll put you in the fucking ground. Jesus Christ, man. You're pent up. Come on, I didn't mean anything by it. I apologize. All right, look, let's rewind. We'll restart. We'll relax. Huh? Come here, page one. Give me a hug. Huh? Give me a hug. <laughs> That's it. Now, where were we? Oh, well, if it isn't my brother the ghost. Maury, what are you doing here, bro? And who's this guy? It's Lou. It's Luis. Right. Well, it's nice to see you too, little brother. Jesus, you look pale. What, somebody die? Unfortunately not, man. What are you doing here, Maury? I am thinking about moving back home. 
Uh, you see, I've been hearing some stories about you getting somewhat uh, above yourself. And I'm worried about you. Oh, don't, don't worry about me, man. I'm fine, okay? I'm gonna be just fucking fine. Jesus, who is training you? Man ought to be horse whipped. Look at you. You, 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 lumpy. Oh, you look like awful, like a, a big pale mess. And you're fat, bro. <laughs> you're fat. <laughs> Screw you, Maury, man. You're, 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 you're perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Chiseled, tan, handsome. I'm the dream ticket. Yeah, mom always warned me that you were a lazy kid. I bet you've been juicing. Of course I haven't. Me do. Ugh. No, no, no. Yeah, I smell it on you. Fear. <laughs> but I'm back now, baby B. I'm b -b 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 back. Oh, and your life just got fun again. <laughs> Come on, Lou. Let's roll. Oh, and uh, fat boy. You better let your friends know about me. Because kibbutz number one. <sighs> Oh, yeah, he's back in town. And this time, dun 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 it's kosher! <laughs> See ya, wouldn't want to be ya, fag. <laughs> because of some small man syndrome that makes you overcompensate. Whoa, whoa, there's nothing small about what I got going on, Lopez. Do you need me to take out the monster? I'll whap that shit on a dashboard and see what you think of it. Yo, yo, you'll think it suddenly got dark in here. I'm talking serious block the sun shit. No, nah, they just don't hold me responsible for your inadequacy issues after that. Uh oh. Oh, don't take nothing out, bro. Keep it to yourself. Keep the monster away from me and listen to what I'm saying. This shit comes from the heart, okay? I don't want to see you getting in over your head. For a man of your height, it's got to be easy to do. Whoa, whoa, slow up, dog. I think you're mistaken in your impression of me. I look like a civilian to you. You look like a lot of things, bro. A lot of neurosis in one tiny package. Kind of like an army knife without the edge. You think because of my lumpy little brother that I don't swing on the dark side? Hey, I never said you weren't a swinger, man. Come to think of it, you might have seen you on one of the West Side kids. All right, enough with the jokes. Look, I done three years Israeli military. I seen shit you wouldn't even believe. Yeah, I done three years helping to run Hercules. I seen shit you wouldn't believe. Hey, how many guys got the juice to get into some foreign legion shit when they're 18? You were probably still sucking on your mama's titty at that age. I was doing time, bro, and leave my mama out of it. Things I saw over there were insane, dog. Insane! I'd tell you about it, but then I'd have to kill you right here. I could do it, too, with my bare hands. Wouldn't even think twice about it. But I won't, Lou. I won't, because I like you. Yeah. Special forces don't even begin to describe my shit. Special sounds about right to me. Look, I came back here after the service, and I changed, man. I changed. You think it's easy sitting down at Econ 101 when you've been icing fools? I wouldn't know, bro. Still got my 4.0, though, didn't I? Go, oh, give it up, right here. Yeah, good for you, bro. You want to send me a resume so we can skip all this personal history crap? No, I want you to understand, Luis, that I got the brain and the brawn, the meat and potatoes. MBA plus IDF equals do not fuck with this bitch. I got it all, brother. I can handle anything. Yeah, OK, fine, whatever. Remind me what we're doing now? We are paying a visit to some of my old uh, business associates. We're going to take over their operation. Clear those fucks out. Perfect. Just perfect. Another fucking war. Fuck yeah! Calculating route. Hey, 
you! Now, what the fuck are you doing here, Maury? Oi vey, motherfuckers! Dude, we told you we ain't in business with you no more. You're a rip-off merchant. <laughs> no more cooperation, my friends. It's hostile takeover time. Hand it over. Fuck you, Maury, you midget prick. You ripped us off for the last time. Let's get these fuckers! are taken out, bro.
you, Fox! No! We did it, man! Now you can take me back to shore! Hey, bro! I can't imagine you got much of a business left now that we've taken out all your employees. Imagination isn't your strong suit, Luis. Let's leave the logistics to me, huh? Hey, I'm more than happy to leave everything to you, Warren. In fact, I don't want to be no part of any of this shit. Correct me if I'm wrong, but you and Tony are business partners, aren't you? Sure. Well, I own Tony. Ergo, I own your ass as well. Get used to it. Hey, no one owes me, bro. Ooh, I beg to differ. Bro, you gonna get out of my face now? Woo! Sure I am, sure. Hey, you did great. I'm feeling real bullish about you, Lou. Real fucking bullish. Good to know. Hey, you come by soon. We got some more shit to discuss. Hey man, you read my blog? Stop! That's it! So where to? Northward, yo. Okay then, here we go. Here we are, then. 